What's up guys, it's me again, Crushed Pixel. In the 13w19a snapshot, Mojang added the stained clay blocks to the game, which are just colored hardened clay blocks, and they look simply better than wool if you want to um, have some builds out of them. They look better than wool as a building material too, so if you build a wool city, it would be a little bit better if they would if it would be out of this hardened clay and it would be also more realistic and you see the colors of the stained clay blocks are the same as the colors of the colored wool blocks and so I decided to write another MC edit filter for you guys to simply replace all of your wool builds to stained clay builds and the filter is pretty simple you just build something out of wool like this and it will be converted to hardened clay like down here and you just have to download the filter and I'll now show you how to apply the filter to any of your builds. Here in MC Edit, you just select your builds which are out of wool and you want to uh, make into stained clay blocks like this and then you go here to filter and select the wool to clay filter and yes you should have checked this because else it won't work obviously and then you just click filter and yes the blocks will look something weird because this is a future block because it's um, only added in the snapshot yet and MC Edit doesn't um, doesn't know these blocks so it just colors them pink okay but it has worked and let's head over to Minecraft again after saving our world. Okay, so back in our Minecraft world, you see it looks really a lot better than the wool building before, even though the colors are not that bright, but that glowstone block in here didn't get replaced by anything because it's not a wool block obviously. And yeah, it's pretty simple, you just have to download and run the filter and this is what turns out. I think it's pretty nice and by the way, in this snapshot 13w22a, um, the attributes and modifiers are currently not working, but Mojang is working on a fix for this, and then the attributes and modifiers filtered by me will work again too. Okay, so see you in the next video then. I hope you enjoyed this MC Edit filter. Bye!